Howdy folks! It's me, Manic Mark, coming to you from the bunker system located underneath the art villa. Happy Friday, everyone! The day started off really snowy, and then the sun came out in its t-shirt weather. It ran all over the place today. I remember I wanted to go... I found another record store in town I didn't know existed. Well, it's been a record store forever. I'm not going to mention the name, but it's, it's still there. I don't know if it's owned by the same person or not. And somebody mentioned it to me that they said, oh, okay, I, I completely forgot about it. So I decided, I, tried, I worked that in, into my, you know, the places that I was going to stop at. Um, so I'm not going to mention the name. Why? Because I walk in this place, and it's like Tink's Charlie's, you know, Tink's, Tink's Charlie's store. <laughs> um, stacked up, you know, all over. Not that bad, but but stacks and stacks, and there's right out like there's these crates, big tall crates, and they've got a sign on that that says like a uh, new overstock, not priced yet. So I'm like, well, and they're all shoved in, so you can't look at them. You know, I mean, all you can do is see the spine. I don't even want to go through that. The other, uh, not, some records on the, like a uh, old record thing, you know, like a uh, you know, and you could flip, and then there's some others you can kind of go through and. And I didn't really see a couple of things, you know, um, but there are all these records underneath. Okay, so I'm like, oh, well, all right. And I'm flipping through them, and um, I, f I find three or four. I'm there for like 15 minutes, okay, going through all these records. And I take these three or four. I'm thinking, I, I can't, I'm not going to go through anymore because this is just crazy the way these things are all stacked up in here. I said, I don't even know how much they got to want for the ones I picked out. So I, I took them up front, and, they, and the guy looks at him and goes, well, these aren't for sale. <laughs> <laughs> I said, <"Why>, what? <laughs> he goes, well, they have no price on them. And I said, well, I, I pulled them out from the, in the back. They were, and he goes, well, no, if they're not priced, I can't sell them. I said, well, how much are they? Well, I just managed the store. The owner only comes in one day a week. Oh, this is ridiculous. I mean, two-thirds of the records you have in the store are accessible to customers in some fashion or another. Not easy. <laughs> <laughs> for a picker like myself, and you have these, you just have these, and I'm and I'm looked at a few of the other ones. And they were kind of high priced, and I'm just like, well, I'm not going to go back there. So that's 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 a shame. That well, I'll put them aside now. Have them call you. Like, yeah, well, whatever. Okay, so he's going to call me up. Anyway, let's get to the record finds. It was at half price day, so I had to pay a dollar piece for these records. And maybe one of the most exciting finds was this um, 10 inch 33 long play. It's Ruth Welcome. Zither and a Dick Marta. It's like a two two records in one. The flip side is uh, Dick Marta, who apparently plays something called the Cymbalome. I've never heard of that. I think that's the, he's what's in, I you know. pleasant percussion, pleasant percussion, one hundred and one strings. I keep finding new ones. They made like three hundred and forty five records. I think the number is. But look at this cover. Look at that girl. What the hell's going on with her? I can't put my legs together because it, it, it itches. I got an itch. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, Brazil's on this. Uh, feelings. Um, the theme from Jaws, for Christ's sakes. You know? They uh, Anyway, I'm looking forward to that. Dynagroove. You know, I've blogged a lot of... Uh, RCA, when they came out with Dynagroove, apparently made a slew of records to promote Dynagroove. For Buick, right? And these are all, uh, there's a song from each one of these albums on this record, okay? Well, what's cool about it is the back, there's the current model of Buick, which would be, looks like a 70 watt to me. It looks like a 71. So that was cool. Three Sons, again, Three Sons albums. And it's the one I've been looking for. Another one, the Magic Carpet cover. This is going to be good. This is one, I think, one of their better albums. Robert Maxwell on Harmony. It's a harp album. I've got one or two other Robert Maxwell uh, uh, harp albums, and it's progressive, um, if I can use that term. I don't have probably the unique, let's say, he, he likes to experiment with the harp, and it can be cool. His work can be really cool. Cha-cha-cha. I've got this one. I've got another one. Classical music from Half Price Books. Price sticker on them. Why? Because it, it gets in the way of the graphics. It's classical music, uh, but it's dramatic classical music. And usually, for some reason, the name I cannot pronounce, but it always comes with some kind of like cheesecake, uh, exotic, exotic cover. 
yeah, baby. Uh, I just got, I just love these, some of these instructional records just for the covers. There's some spoken word on it, some music, and I have no idea what to expect from that. But it was a, a great cover. Um, Jackie Gleason, Night Winds, got it. Great album. Trading material. Al Morgan, Jealous Heart. Uh, this is a local uh, manufactured uh, Wright Records. Um, nobody wants, you're not going to want to go out and get any Al Morgan records, I'm telling you. But he's a local guy, and I, I just collect local, local stuff. So there you go. Jackie Gleason, music to remember her by. Art and Dottie Todd. Who is Art and Dottie Todd? I have no idea. This is percussive, percussive banjos. Eddie K. Kaula. I uh, have no idea. Um, out of Vancouver, Canada. It's autographed on the back, though. So, yeah. Aldorf music. Cheesy cheesecake. Cheesy cheesecake cover. That's a mysterious cover on this Roger Williams album. Ray Hartley, a pianist. Uh, 1958 album. Uh, King Records. I found a King Records at Goodwill. Couldn't believe that. Hardly ever, like I say, hardly ever find King Records. And here's a guy playing his sparkly organ. Look, his organ's all sparkly. It's brown. Cheesecake on budget, the budget Waldorf label. Check out that vibrant, pulsating cover. It's got Hawaiian war chant on it. Look at this horrible cover. Holy crap. Holy crap. Imagination in me. Apparently, I shouldn't say that's horrible because it looks pretty much like the shit that I draw. <laughs> Anyway, one color cover, and there's two guys on the back singing, Put your dreams in your sack. Put your dreams in your sack. Bring your own Wilbur along. Usually my Wilbur's attached to my sack, and I bring it everywhere I go. White Southern Gospel. This one, there's no, there's no photograph on it, but it's called the Re-Crucification. That's a term I have to look up. I'm not familiar with that. You think just being crucified once was plenty. Pathway to heaven. There's the pathway to heaven. There's three people there. And then there's four people there. Win the lost. Losers shall be winners. Win the, lo win the lost. There you go. That's on artists. That's local. Gospel singing. Get together. It's a compilation album of many local local uh, groups that I've blogged in the past. Okay. And that looks good, too. Anyway, there you go. Wrap it up. Thanks, folks, for stopping by. And I hope you're no more afraid now than when you click the clicky thing. And have a great week. And I'll be talking at you later. See ya. Oh, the man of Galilee On the cross of Calvary Was dying for sinners like me Dripping down on the cross and on the ground, there was one drop shed just for me, just for me to save my poor soul, just to cleanse and make me free and whole. As his blood was dripping down on the cross and on the ground. There was one drop shed just for me He was flesh like you and I But on the cross he had to die As he hung there upon the tree And as his blood was dripping down On the cross and on the ground There was one drop shed just for me just for me to save my poor soul Just to cleanse and make me free and whole As his blood was dripping down On the cross and on the ground There was one drop shed just for me
they pierced his precious side. Oh, forgive them now, he cried, as he hung there in agony. And as his blood was dripping down on the cross and on the ground, there was one drop shed just for me. Just for me to save my poor soul. Stripping down on the cross and on the ground, there was one drop shed just for me.